Lily King win the skins. What would Jason Lezak and company pick for the Cali Cotters? Even Lezak's 10-year-old son, Ryan Lezak, got on message him right away. You want to know, would it be breaststroke? Would it be backstroke? Olivia Schmaliga had to be happy that she gets a chance to do the backstroke skins. Yeah, the Lezak family back home watching this, and this is certainly a family affair for them. Everybody's engaged. Big Three big wins for Smaliga yesterday. She won the 50 back, a couple relay wins, including that medley relay that put her into the skins. And I think it's a toss-up. I mean, everybody thinks it should be Lily King, but I, I think here in the 50 backstroke, Smaliga has been just as dominant as King, maybe even more dominant than King in the 50. Certainly, King, all she does is win, but there are a lot of great 50 breaststrokers, and uh, right now, Smaliga is on fire. Watch your teammate, Bita Nelson, could be a factor, but this one looks like it is Smaliga, and this is her only race until she gets to skin, so what, she's got a good hour and a half before she has to swim again. So she can let this one loose. Maliga trying to win this 100 backstroke for the fifth time. Last time she swam it, she scored 15 points. This could be another big jackpot. And if you look at it on paper, Zavino right underneath in lane number one has the second fastest time behind Smaliga Lifetime. They're both ranked sixth and seventh in history, but she did that back way back in 2014. Don't expect her to be a factor here. Yeah, Zavina was the world short course champion back in 2012 in the 200 backstroke. Bita Nelson won the 200 back. Yeah, if anything, but Bita Nelson is going to be chores from the breakers. Looks pretty good right there going out. Smaliga. Nelson Chores, I mean, this is a big swim for Chores. Boy, again, here she is. Won bronze at the European Short Course Championships in the 50 back, and look at her go, hanging right in there with all these swimmers. And remember, Bita Nelson set the American record back in college at Wisconsin, and it's Nelson and Schmoliga, but Schmoliga has the final push. She touches the wall first, 56-23. Another great swim by Smaliga, but how about yours? I like her swim, 57-1. She goes her best time she's ever been in her life from five years ago to get third for the New York Breakers. And just what they need, another third place finish, but this was all Smaliga. Now she can put this one to bed. Not as happy with the time, I'm sure, because she went 55-4, about a half second faster last week. But boy, she really came Pouring home right there to the left. You could see her just charging at the end. I think she'll be happy with the victory. Let's get out of here. Take another hour and 20 minutes or so. Rest up and get ready for those skins. Olivia Schmoliga, second time this season. She scored 15 points in the 100 backstroke. And we all should, should note that DC try and they were the only other team to score any points because they were stolen away by the Cali Condors and it's big for them because they would love to climb up from fourth place again for the teams at the end of this match four points for first only one point for fourth place <laughs> Cali Condors Olivia Schmoliga one two in that battle Mark Olivia one two for the Cali Condors yes.